my client wants to know why you're asking that. It relates to a murder inquiry. You should answer that. Do you want to ask him? Uh, my client wants I to... I heard. So you wouldn't mind giving us a DNA sample? Prince Charles Edward Stewart. I understand congratulations are in order for Madame and the Marquis as well. I apologize, I thought... We haven't formally announced it yet, uh, but an heir, it's uh, the most incredible news, is it not? I am to congratulate you. Dante. Dante. Poca miseria. Your pardon, sir, but I'm a little in the dark as to your meaning. I don't want to be here. Mr. B, you're visiting us again. Elaine's not at home. Elaine. Have you tried a mobile? Yeah, she's not picking up. Look, uh, social services say it's not risk, and with no respite care, I wouldn't blame her for running away. Should I be at the party? Oh, no, no, no. Let's go and find you somewhere nice and quiet to sit, all right? Come on. You OK? Yeah? Can you come with me, Mr. B? Ray! Come on, it's me, Elaine. Elaine. Now, we took a report from the Browns of Rosalind and Justine Brown. Whatever's going on in this case, I want to know about it. All right, if you'll take a seat. No, you need to talk to me right now. Ma'am, please, please have a seat. Ma'am? I just want to go over it all one more time, ma'am. When was the last time you saw your son? Do you remember the exact time? You need to be speaking to Rosalind. I already talked to Mrs. Brown, ma'am. She says she had a job interview at four and was in a rush. She asked Alan to come inside, but he never did. False alarm. House is empty. Check the back again, see what you can find. I spoke with the Browns, and Mrs. Brown thinks he got into their drinks cabinet and helped himself. Kids can be curious in his age. You look in my baby's face and you tell me that he drank enough liquor that he couldn't stand and then took a three and a half mile stroll and fell into the river. Thank you for coming in this morning, Dr. Campbell. If you're anything like other doctors we've treated, I imagine you've read everything there is to read about this treatment. Pretty much. So forgive me if what I'm about to say sounds like I'm teaching you to suck eggs. Is sucking eggs part of the procedure? I must have missed that particular article. If only it were. We'll need you here every day for five weeks. But I've rearranged my surgery hours. Rearranged? Your Honor, my learned friend says there are substantial grounds to believe that Mr. Wicks would fail to surrender to bail. He's trying to walk free. He tried to rape my sister. Simply nonsense. Now, if that person had, in fact, been conscious and then was suddenly submerged, would there be a shock to the system? Yes, if it were unexpected. And if a shock were received due to a sudden submersion, would consciousness be kept or would that be lost? That would be lost at once. You mean immediately after submersion? Yes. Or almost immediately? Actually, immediately. Thank you, Doctor. Dad said he would always trust my judgment. Of course he did. He said those exact words. Right, was that before or after you screwed up tree walkers? That gave me all his savings to set that up. That's how much he trusted me. That's not true. He wouldn't have done that. Just not fair! 